What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video, I'm going to show you six different methods of taking screenshots on Xiaomi 14, Xiaomi 14 Ultra or whatever Xiaomi smartphone you got. So here we go. So here is our Xiaomi 14. So to use all of these different methods of taking screenshots on your Xiaomi smartphone, some of them you will have to activate from the settings first. So first of all, go to the settings, scroll down, go to the additional settings, then go to gesture shortcuts. Here you will find two options, take a screenshot, partial screenshot. Go to each of them and turn on all of these options. If any of them are turned off, just tap on the slider, turn them on and we are good to go. So the very first method is the combination of the power button and volume down. So for example, if I want to take a screenshot of this home screen, all I have to do is press the power key and volume down key together like this and the screenshot is captured. So now if I go to the gallery, then go to the album section, you will find here is a folder called screenshots and screen recordings. If I tap on this, this is the screenshot that we have just captured. This is an image. If you want, you can do all of the customizations. You can crop it, you can apply some filter. So this is the method number one. To take a screenshot on your Xiaomi 14, just press the power key and volume down key together, press and hold them like this and a screenshot will be captured. The method number 2 to take the screenshot is with the help of 3 fingers. So all you have to do is put your 3 fingers on the screen and swipe down like this and a screenshot will be captured. You can do this on any screen. As you can see, a screenshot is captured. All you have to do, put your three fingers on the screen and swipe them down together like this and the screenshot will be captured. So this is the method number two. The method number three is the partial screenshot. In this, you have to put your three fingers on the display, but you don't have to move. Just press and hold them on the display and then you will get some options like this. So now you can see that we are getting three options here at the top. The first one is a square then freehand and then circle. If you select the freehand, then you can also select later the square or the circle. But if you first select a square or circle, then you cannot select the freehand. Let me show you how it works. So right now it is square. Let me select freehand. Then I can move my finger on the display and a screenshot will be captured. Now, instead of freehand, if I want to switch to circle or square, I can do that. You can see and then I can just tap on save button here and the screenshot will be saved in that way. But if I select square first, for example, like this, then I can switch to circle or oval, but the freehand option will be disabled. In any way, based on your preference, you can use any of these three options using the partial screenshot method on your Xiaomi 14 smartphone. So all you have to do, put your three fingers on the display, wait a bit, and then you will get the option to capture a screenshot on your Xiaomi 14 smartphone. So this is the method number three. Method number four is from the quick toggle menu. If you go here, you can see there is an option called screenshots. If you tap on this, a screenshot will be captured. So this is the method number four. And once again, it works on any screen, any display. For example, if I'm at Play Store, all I have to do is swipe down, tap on screenshots, and a screenshot will be captured. Once again, if you go to the gallery, then you go to screenshots and screen recording. Here is the screenshot that we have just captured. All of these are screenshots we were capturing. Now for the method number five, once again, you have to go to the settings, scroll down, go to the additional settings, go to the quick ball. Just tap on this and make sure that quick ball option is turned on if it is not, just tap on the slider. After that, go to the select shortcuts. Go here and make sure that the screenshot is selected. If not, you can just tap on any of these options and select the screenshot from there to add this screenshot option into your quick ball. Once the quick ball is activated, you have to just tap on the quick ball icon. You can see it here right next to the music. Just tap on this and then you will see this quick ball will appear showing the six options that we were seeing just few seconds before in our settings. So here is the screenshot option. If you just tap on this, a screenshot will be captured. So this is the method number five using the quick ball. Just activate it, add the screenshot in the list of apps 
then tap on quick ball and then tap on screenshot option and the screenshot will be captured so this is the method number five now method number six is the option to take the screenshot of a whole page so so far we were taking the screenshots of just one page for example if we are on a page where multiple pages are there and you want to take the screenshot of the whole page so now let's see if i want to capture the screenshot of all of these pages then all i have to do is take a screenshot using any of the previous method i have shown except the partial screenshot so now let's see if i use the combo of power button and the volume down the screenshot is captured and now you can see there is an option coming called a scroll if i go to the home page and try to take the screenshot you can see a scroll option is disabled because this page is just one single page it cannot be a scroll down but if i go to the settings here you can see we have multiple pages so now if i take a screenshot then the scroll option is getting enabled just tap on this and it will start scrolling the page by itself and then it will finish the whole process now if you want to capture it once again not the whole page just a bit of it then you can drag and drop and select how much of the content you would like to be captured in your screenshot and after that you can just tap on this check mark and the screenshot will be captured now once again if i go to the gallery then screenshots this is the long screenshot we have just captured as you can see so these are the six methods that you can use on your Xiaomi 14, Xiaomi 14 Ultra, whatever Xiaomi smartphone you got to take screenshots. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, then give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for future uploads. And I'll see you guys next time in another video. Have a nice day.